Welcome everyone, you may be trying to upgrade to iOS 16, but it's not showing up in settings. Well, I've upgraded my iPhone 10 to iOS 16, so how on earth does my iPhone 12 mini not have the update? It's because you need to do the following steps. So iOS 16 releases Monday, September 12th at 6 p.m. British Standard Time. Well, I got iOS 16 early, how? Well, you're gonna open up the Safari browser and you want to search up for iOS 16 public beta. You want to tap on the Apple link right here and it should bring you to the Apple beta website. You're gonna scroll all the way down. You have the option to sign up or if you're already a member, sign in. Sign up means you will need to enter in your Apple ID details and then follow the on-screen instructions. In my case, I'm already a member, so I'm gonna tap on sign in and it's going to sign in to my account. So from here, you'll be brought to this page, a guide for public betas. Just scroll all the way down until you see enroll your iOS device, and then it should bring you onto a new website right here, of course still by Apple. You're gonna scroll all the way down, and then where you see download profile, just tap on download profile. So now you're gonna see this website is trying to download a configuration profile. Just tap on allow, and then close. From here, you're gonna open up the settings app. You want to find where it says general. You're then gonna find where it says VPN and device management. Then tap on the downloaded profile, tap on install, enter in your passcode, install, install. And when it says restart required, that is not required, so tap on not now. So from here, when we go to the software update page, for 99% of people, iOS 16 is now showing up early. This is the version which will release tomorrow. Now, if you're watching this video and you still don't see iOS 16 after following all of those steps, quickly check in VPN and device management. If you have any older beta software profiles, if you do, delete them. If you have a TV OS profile, you will need to delete that as well. If this still doesn't work, what that means is that your device does not support iOS 16. Therefore, iOS 16 will not show up on your device when it releases to the general public. Unfortunately, the only way to get iOS 16 is buying a new iPhone. Uh, that's how it goes. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.